The fight over changing the name of Washington Lee High School is picking up steam tonight. Just as a lawsuit over the matter heads to court, members of a committee charged with choosing a new name are speaking out. They tell our Virginia Bureau Chief Peggy Fox that the process up to now was a sham. The process was very unfair. Julie Cruel is an alum of Washington Lee High School, named after two generals, George Washington and Robert E. Lee. The Arlington County School Board voted last summer to ditch the name Robert E. Lee because he led the Confederacy in its fight to keep slavery legal. The board picked a committee to choose a new name. Julie Cruel was on that committee as a representative of the alumni. If the school board really did want to look at the community and their feelings, that they really did not do it. In protest, she abstained from voting. Two other members quit the committee in protest. One is Patrice Kelly, whose daughter attends Washington Lee. The process was so manipulative, we were told not to express our opinions. We were brought in to give our opinions as members of the community and instead we were manipulated and directed to vote in a certain way. And at that point I realized this was not an opportunity to provide community input. This was um, to play a role as a puppet in a predestined conclusion and I resigned. Kelly says there was an effort underway to pick another Lee like Harper Lee, but they were told to only express their opinions to the names they were, quote, being fed. One of those was loving for the landmark civil rights decision that struck down laws banning interracial marriage. The committee chose loving. Student Chloe Slater so, was on the committee uh, and like likes the name. the name. I like the name uh, Washington Loving because loving, to me, it just represents the um, diversity that Washington Lee has, as well as inclusion and acceptance. But these alums and community members say most people in the community want to keep the name Lee. Dean Fleming with the Alumni Association says that sentiment is evident in hundreds of emails. It's keep the name, keep the name, keep the name, keep the name. Washington and Lee mom Tony Delancey says there's good reason to keep the name Lee. I'm also a graduate of West Point and my husband is a graduate of West Point. Robert E. Lee is a graduate of West Point. West Point graduates are willing to lay down their life for their fellow man, and that's honorable. That's what I choose to focus on when I look at this man. A lawsuit by two students and alums who want to keep the name Washington and Lee heads to court this Wednesday. Despite that lawsuit, the renaming appears to be moving forward because on Thursday, the renaming committee presents its recommendations to the school board. The top choice is Washington and Loving. The backup is Washington and Liberty. In Arlington County, Peggy Fox, WUSA 9. And Peggy tells us the Arlington School Board is scheduled to officially choose the new name for Washington and Lee January 10th.